Looking for the most powerful walkie-talkies? We've got you covered. We chose the most powerful GMRS radios for this set to go beyond FRS radios because they are limited to a maximum of 2 watt transmit power. Our criteria went beyond just transmit power, as the FCC limits GMRS handhelds to around 5 watts. For a truly powerful walkie-talkie, the power must balance with performance. This criteria brought an interesting but unusual result. The most powerful HTs that made the cut for our list belong to a single company, Ocean. True power combines with performance, and that's where Ocean stands out. Although pricier, their radios offer superior performance and user experience, thanks to their high-quality super heterodyne receivers. In short, Oshun's walkie-talkies, despite their higher cost, outperform cheaper models in transmission, reception, and overall experience. Our list features the most powerful walkie-talkies that deliver on all fronts. Check the video description for prices and more details. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and share your thoughts in the comments below. So let's get started. Number 3. Oshun KG S88G Oshun KG S88G is among the higher-end offerings of the company's well-received KG series, and it brings a few changes and upgrades to this lineup. A very obvious change in the aesthetics is the choice of colors, where the conventional black casing is offset with panels of another color. Many of us find these splashes of color refreshing, but those who prefer the conventional coloring can choose the gray color option. The GMRS HT is fairly light and has a compact body, yet it manages to keep an overall good and satisfying feel in the hands. Improving on the form that's fit for the outdoors, Oshun has made this radio IP67 dustproof and waterproof. That means the radio can survive being submerged in water up to a depth of a meter for about 30 minutes. This is an improvement over other models in the KG series, including the KG905G and KG935G, which are rated IP66. The waterproofing is more than welcome, but it also brings a little annoyance that affects another cool feature, which is the USB-C charging. The charging port is at the side of the device and can help charge its 2000 mAh battery rather quickly. However, to maintain the waterproofing, the USB-C port is covered by a flap, which in turn is secured by a screw. Now, let's get to the features and performance part. The radio uses a super heterodyne receiver, which works with the good quality speaker to ensure that you receive clear audio and also handles noise better. Its audio quality remains remarkable during transmission and delivers a clear and good signal. You can transmit at two power levels, with 1 watt being the low end and 5 watt being the high power RF output. Users can have 400 custom channels, and it's possible to name these channels directly from the radio, without programming it with a computer. There's a UI improvement for this purpose, and users can name the channels more easily using the channel dial and PS key. I think taking advantage of the full keypad for typing in names would be easier, but that would probably have to wait. Speaking of the keypad, this HT has a backlit full DTMF keypad, which has a nice tactile feel to it. The display is small, but is bright with good contrast, and remains visible even under the sun. Overall, the Oshun KG S88G GMRS radio is an excellent pick for those who want power and performance from their walkie-talkie, and can afford the premium pricing that comes with such privileges. Our ratings for features is 9 out of 10. Value for money, 8.5 out of 10. Audio clarity, 9 out of 10. Display, 8.5 out of 10. For an overall rating of 9 out of 10. Number 2, Oshun KG935G+. As its name implies, Oshun KG935G+, is an upgrade over the Oshun KG935G. While both models continue to look the same visually, the features and upgrades brought to the newest Plus model were notable enough for Oshun to discontinue the production of the previous model. 
One of the more notable changes is the introduction of USB-C charging with the presence of the charging port and circuitry on the battery itself. To make room for the circuitry, the battery went from 3200 mAh in the 935G to 2600 mAh in the Plus version. Though the battery capacity changed, it's an acceptable trade-off for the convenience that comes with the USB charging. The radio also has a better and louder speaker now, which works rather well with the good quality receiver to deliver clear audio. The receiver quality is an important benchmark, especially for this radio, since it gives up the company's usual super heterodyne receiver approach and instead moves to the more common direct conversion receiver. Its overall construction looks the part of a quality radio and is both robust and easy on the eyes. The casing is pretty solid and helps with the radio's IP66 rating, which means it is dustproof and water resistant in a way that it can handle jets of water like heavy rain, but it should not be submerged in water. The HT has a big and bright screen that offers full colors and options for multiple themes. Many of the newer models from Ocean, including this HT and the Q-Series radios, offer these colorful themes for the display. And while this is a purely cosmetic feature, I think it works great and adds a little bit of liveliness and personal touch to the HD. One downside of this type of displays is that their visibility suffers under the sunlight though it's not a huge problem. Oshun usually excels with its UI, and this radio is no different. Many of its features are easily accessible and can be managed directly from the transceiver without the need for programming through a computer. For example, you can directly enter a specific frequency from the keypad or name a channel to your convenience and set up the programmable buttons. There is room enough for 999 custom channels, though it doesn't allow channel groups. It can transmit and receive on UHF for the GMRS channels, and it can also receive on the full UHV and VHF channels, plus commercial FM radio, so you'll have plenty of channels to entertain yourself, if you intend to simply listen to the radio. So you'll have plenty of channels to entertain yourself, if you intend to simply listen to the radio. It can receive NOAA weather channels, and can handle weather alerts without interfering with the scan mode. Overall, Oshun KG935G Plus is a delightful GMRS radio that's suitable for all users. Its well-managed UI and quality features make it suitable for beginners, while more experienced users can enjoy the quality and options offered by this powerful walkie-talkie. Our ratings for features are 9 out of 10. Value for money, 9 out of 10. Audio clarity, 9 out of 10. Display, 9.5 out of 10 for an overall rating of 9 out of 10. Number 1. Ocean KG Q10G, our top choice. Performance, style, good user interface, and ease of use all come packed neatly in the Ocean KG Q10G GMRS radio, thus making it our choice for the best overall GMRS radio. It's a relatively new model that's rich in features and implements them quite well. Oshun has maintained its focus on quality and aesthetics. The radio is available in four colors, has a bright color display, and a generally pleasing aesthetic. On top of that, you can set up color themes to match your preference. It sounds a bit gimmicky at first, but upon use, I found the themes likable and a nice touch. On the downside, like with most color displays on similar radios, this one too has sunlight as its kryptonite and doesn't fare well in bright daylight. The large display has room to show and monitor two channels at a time. Since this is a super heterodyne radio, this is true monitoring. Building on that, the radio has two PTT buttons on its side, followed by two customizable action buttons. These features are a slight departure from conventional Oshun models like the KG UV9G series. While the quality of the transceiver remains the same, the focus on design and appearance is a welcome touch. Additionally, the KGQ10G is also a proving ground for newer modules like GPS and improvements in UI. On the other side of the radio, there's a flap that hides a USB-C connector for charging the battery. You can use a USB-C charging cable, though it's not included in the box. What is included 
is the conventional cradle charger that takes its sweet time powering the 3000 mAh battery, though it's better for battery life. A little above this is another flap, secured by screws. That's where you can connect external speakers and programming cable. The reason for these flaps is that this is an IP67 dustproof and waterproof device and can survive being submerged in water. It is programmable via Ocean software, though a fair bit can be handled directly through the radio. The user interface is simple and intuitive. There are two menus here. The first opens up the simple, most used functions, while the second menu takes you to all the available options. Another cool feature here is the built-in GPS. It tracks its position and can send and receive GPS data from other Q10 series radios. If it has GPS coordinates from another radio, it can show their presence relative to your own position on the screen. However, its limited capability and inability to show GPS data on a smartphone limits what could otherwise have been a remarkable addition. The reception capabilities here are phenomenal. Apart from the GMRS band, it can receive NOAA channels and sound weather alerts. CB radio transmissions in AM and FM, airband in AM, and more since the receiver goes all the way from 76 MHz to 999 MHz. It does a good job in outclassing competition like the BTEC GMRS Pro. BTEC is no match to the Super Heterodyne receiver, the polished user interface, and overall better quality of Ocean. However, BTEC does score a few points with Bluetooth smartphone connectivity and a more attractive pricing. Though all that innovation and new development is worthy of praise, the radio doesn't forget to include and improve upon conventional features as well. So the RF output power gets up to 6 watts coupled with 4 TX power levels. And it offers conventional features like Roger Beep, Vox, Talk Around, CT CSS, DCS, both standard and non-standard. It's repeater capable. It has 999 memory channels, programming options for PTD keys, and more. Overall, Ocean KG-Q10G is a wonderful high-end GMRS radio with great build quality and features. It's suitable for just about anyone as long as you can justify the high price tag. Our ratings for features are 9.5 out of 10. Value for money, 8 out of 10. Audio clarity, 9.5 out of 10. Display, 9.5 out of 10 for an overall rating of 9 out of 10. So what do you think? Which of these is the most powerful walkie-talkie for you? Or do you think another walkie-talkie is better? Tell us in the comments below, and don't forget to like and subscribe. Have an awesome day.